I'm just counting the lady that I dated. When you're in traffic, when two oh! cameras pass by each other. He's not the stereotype. Tourist. <laughs> they do. Yes. Yes, Evan, Evan. After lunch, mm. after dinner. If they are not having Raka. They actually drink you. tea with Raka. Oh yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I can confirm, don't need to watch. Oh. Yes, Turkish series for sure. And now that I have a Turkish girlfriend, we started watching soap opera. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Before I was not. Yeah. <laughs> it's like now it's tea time. Because so jealous. Yeah, so jealous. Mm. Yes, Evan. You're watching three hours of soap opera that talks about drama, jealousy. Bravo, <laughs> bravo, yeah, yeah, bravo. <laughs> bravo. What song started? I know it's Birbachi for sure. Hi everyone and welcome back to uh, the reaction guys. Here you go again with Turkish videos. This one guys will be so interesting, like so interesting through our mythology. Okay, we are talking about Turkish people react to stereotypes. Every country in the world has stereotypes. Like guys, Simpsons, come on guys, all the years, okay? In two Italians are at Simpsons, one guy has a restaurant, pizza, pasta, the other guys is mafia so guys every country has their stereotypes and we will have a lot of fun with turkish stereotypes okay and turks will respond to this one so guys let's go and let's enjoy this video let's go guys yeah i hope it will be a lot of fun that's not true <laughs> no it's not <laughs> I'm just counting the lady that I dated. When you're in traffic, when two oh! cameras pass by each other and there's an eye contact. Uh, I'm just counting the lady that I dated. Open. Oh, come on, man. I'm just counting the ladies that I dated. Come on, that was good. You're in traffic when two camel passes by each other and there's an eye contact. Uh, that's how mostly, you know, people meet. And there's an app actually called... I camel. I camel. <laughs> Yeah, they did. I came up. I can say like, you know, Turkey is quite a diverse country, so... Yes, the Western side is completely free to date. You can date anybody you want, male, female. Towards East, it's it's a little bit more challenging. So families have a lot of impact on when it comes to dating and okay. marriages. People sometimes need to hide their dating. And are there arranged marriages in Turkey? Yes, yes sir. Okay. Oh. Also, family is important. They just don't say like good. people are getting married. It's also like the families they are getting married too. So how did you? How did you meet? Çok sıkıcı bir hikayemiz var bence. Evet. Çok böyle çalıştığımız yerde tanıştık yani. <gülüyor> ya benim aklımda ikimizin de aklında hiç evlilik yoktu bu arada. Ya. <laughs> all my friends are online dating and they have the same concerns as a, as a North American about online dating. So it's quite okay. global, I would say. Oh, they are at Instagram asking. They ask at Instagram, this I can make this too. Tourist and tea and coffee all day. Oh, yes, yes, yes. He's not a stereotype. He's not a stereotype. Tourist. <laughs> they do. Yes. Yes, Evet, Evet, Evet. Turkish tea on breakfast, after breakfast. Turkish coffee. All Turkish day. Coffee. And then lunch. I don't think they drink tea over after lunch. After lunch. After lunch, mm. after dinner. If they are not having raka. They Turkish actually drink tea with raka. Oh yeah, that's too. true. <laughs> Turkish coffee actually is very strong, okay? But tea is like crazy. Everyone <laughs> keep drinking oh, yeah. tea. Yeah. And summer too, I asked to you on my YouTube page and Instagram and everyone is like, Sure, man, and summer too. Why not? <laughs> Crazy. What the fuck? My mom is just like before even like she goes to sleep. Sometimes she drinks coffee. Oh yeah. Even like just watch some Turkish TV show programs. Like there's always tea there. Like I mean, just constantly. At work, yeah. Everybody has a tea lady or tea man, right? Oh Change yeah. It. Oh yeah. Some people has a really good talent to read the Turkish coffee cup after you finish it. Oh and yes. Then, uh, they can see your future. Önce kahve içersin, sonra 
e, dibine tarvesi kalır. Kapatırsın. Üstüne yüzünü bırakırsın ve şekiller oluşur. Yo, come on. You forget that you need to turn around three times like this. Come on guys, I need to show you everything. <laughs> I didn't know when I go to Turkish restaurant, okay? Uh, I finish my coffee that I asked to a Turkish girl that was like very nice. Can you look my destiny, okay? And she teach me how to do it. And when I was at the restaurant, she teach me, okay, that I need to put uh, my coffee like this and then turn around three times and she read my destiny. Actually, it was very nice and I had a lot of fun. I will not say to you, my destiny because I don't want to share. Let's go. <laughs> it is it is interesting. It's a lot of bullshitting, I would say. Um, <laughs> yeah, of course. No offense. <laughs> it's kind of a way to talk about things that are may not yeah, be socially it's accepted. Fun. Yeah, it's true. It's true. It's true. Turkish better. Players? No. No. I don't, I don't know if womanizer is the right word. I think I think they're tenacious, passionate. They're obsessive sometimes. If they want yep. something, they they will do anything to, to oh, yeah. get that. <laughs> no, it's not positive. <laughs> Kendisi çok eski çapkınlardan böyle söylediğine bakmıyor. O yüzden cevabı veremedim. Tamamen yalan söylüyor şu anda. Tourists from like Russia, Germany or whatever. They come there for five days, one week and they are like just approaching. Hello, how are you? Are you good? Are you disco? Are you cold? Like, yeah. it's like, kind of like very limited English, but they still want to move on to a yeah. tourist woman. So they're oh, like, yeah. are you disco? Means like, you want to go to disco. Yeah. Yeah. Are you <laughs> disco? Are you, are you a Come on, man. I mean, no, it's not, no. A lot of men who think the world is revolved around them. And you can find a bunch of them in Turkey as well. Powered by religion, culture, powered by uh, mama's calling men. They're the kings and the, the prince of, the, of their family. Yes, yes. So, yeah, through, okay, let's go, Turks are obsessed with their soap operas, oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, I can confirm, no need to watch, oh. yes, Turkish series, for sure. Ben bizimiz vardır, akşamlar çok izlenir, biz izlemiyoruz ikimiz ama biz genel televizyon oluyoruz. Ben izliyorum, yok. And now that I have a Turkish girlfriend, we started watching soap opera. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Before I was not. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, now it's tea time. Every Wednesday we're watching Sadakatsiz. Okay. Beautiful. <laughs> Come on, man. It's show ever. O bir batak zaten. Yani o batağa girdin ve bir daha çıkamıyorsun. Hala izliyor çünkü. He's a threat. Yatakta döner, dönüyor, oradan şey yapıyor. I watch Yargı every Sunday. How long do you soap operas go for? 10 hours. No. No. With, with commercial three no, hours. No, with commercial three hours, without commercial two hours. <laughs> no, guys, too much. It's like a, it's like a movie every single day. It's too much. And we're good at it. It makes it happen. I love this video. It's like one of the most yeah. funniest videos ever. Cry, maybe, but I'm like, why is this happening? And I don't want to cry, but yeah, it's good. So it's like a lot of emotions. Yeah, true. Come on, man. I know that too. Let's see. Turkish cuisine consists mainly of kebab. No, no, this is stereotype. <laughs> this is a stereotype. Everyone eats sushi in Japan all the time. Some parts, people do eat kebab for yeah. lunch, dinner. Yeah, you like you say, we're about Italy. Okay, pizza, pasta, sure. We eat a lot of pizza, pasta, but there are a lot of things, okay? Like same as Turkey, for sure. <laughs> Go there, you come back with a heartburn. And some parts of Turkey, um, close But yeah, kebab is like they, they, they most famous one. Influence. It's very fish, seafood heavy and vegetable heavy diet. And about kebab, it's just like yeah, one, one type of uh, Food, like like there's a, like a doner kebab, adana kebab. Also, yeah. Like just became popular like with uh with Turkish immigrants that went to like Germany and it's easy easy take out like a food and I think just it just started there. Can you guys tell me what your favorite Turkish dish is? Seçkin genel okay. benimle onu ben de sevdiğim için dalga da. Bir sürü şey var ben de. Ama ben... çiğ köfte de yeriz ya. <laughs> We have like stuffed grape leaves. Oh my god, it's my favorite. Put some yogurt. Okay. In. It's like paradise. But I do like <laughs> with kebab. I would say. Um, no, I don't. I'm not a meat person. <laughs> İmam bayıldı. Isn't it meat though? Yes, but not kebab. <laughs> <laughs> come on, girl. Yeah, we, come on. I I know this. Tasuar, yeah, both. 
Tools tend to get dramatic and general. Oh yes, oh yes, like how I just did one time a video that was not Turkish. Oh yes, oh yes, this like Avi Reaction. Because <laughs> so jealous, yeah, so jealous, absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Yes, yes. Amen. You're watching three hours of soap opera that talks about drama, jealousy. Bravo, <laughs> bravo, <laughs> yeah, bravo, <laughs> bravo. <laughs> Bravo, man. You watch the hours of soap opera, how cannot you be dramatic? Bravo, you get on the point. I think it comes from like our genes. Like, you have to be jealous. Kind, kind of what? Like, that jealousy yeah. is kind of like, I care about you, I love you, look. You That's have to be around me, so, so people see it like that. Exactly. Mm. So yeah, absolutely. Like, oh, you don't, you don't love me. Yeah, it's In confirming. Way, yeah. It's confirming that there's passion. Mm -hmm. There is a kind of love. On yeah, the contrary, I, I, I feel that I, ne I could never in my life date a, a Turkish girl, okay? Because will say to me always, you don't care about me because I'm like zero, like zero, zero jealous, okay? So. Seeing how Turks approach this jealous thing, okay? I think I could never date, okay? Because, come on, you say, you don't care about me because, like, I'm zero, zero jealous. So, it's a little bit bad, but actually I'm like that. So, I need to watch some soap operas to become. In North America, no one wants to be with someone who's jealous. It confirms there's insecurity. I think it's so about people in warmer countries, they're, they're more jealous, I feel like that. <laughs> Okay? Yeah, true, hundred percent. Come on, man. It was the most annoying stereotype you get as a tour. That's it. Western country, so Turkey, okay, then camels, deserts. <laughs> yeah, okay. The problem are camels. Like thinking that we're living in deserts? Yeah. That's not true. We are surrounded by seas, like, you know, the Black Sea, Mediterranean Sea and all that, so. Oh, you're dark because you're from Turkey. It's so sunny all the time out there. It was like, Ooh. sometimes it's cold. I mean, we have four seasons, like. What's one thing you want the world to know about Turks? Go to Asia, take a ferry to go to Europe site, grab a tea, and before your tea gets cold, you can actually, you know, go from Asia to Europe. It's a fun experience in Istanbul. The land yeah. is so diverse. There are a lot of people from a lot of uh, neighbors uh, from Turkey that brings their own culture, own food, own language. It's pretty much representative of the history that you can find in Turkey. Absolutely. You know, people do go like Antalya and this Turkey for that. Yeah, like, Antalya, everyone. Country, like, if you go like, I'm saying like, oh, we also have some, do you have some? Cappadocia, oh, Antalya, yeah. Istanbul, yeah, just think desert. Izmir. There's no desert. I think there's one little in Konya, even if it's not, I don't know whether it's desert or not. <laughs> Love this guy. <laughs> what songs are these? I know it's Birbachi for sure. <laughs> oh, I love this song. <laughs> Okay, and now, oh guys, what a fun video, mamma mia, I had crazy fun with this video, seriously, so, so fun, let me know in the comments your opinion about this one, and I can ask you on my Instagram too about stereotypes, etc, so don't forget to follow me on Instagram so you can respond to, and I'll see you in the next reaction, ciao a tutti ragazzi, e noi ci vediamo alla prossima, ciao!